Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home and bring well, good uh, news. My name is Daniel and this name is Pelican for some reason. For this name, fuck. <laughs> you see what I'm working with. <laughs> we can always enter from Anyways. Uh, we're playing Dishonored. Go down. Go down. Yup. Stop right there. Oh, you got fucked it, Jim. You fucked it hard. Um, I feel like that's not the best place for you to put a gun on your chest. I mean, I feel like it would be like really awkward to grab it like that. You would like chicken wing it up in the air while you grab it. <laughs> Haven't you ever seen Black Flag? Like, pick up the idea from this game. Like, with the double pistols on Yeah, those are on the front of his chest. They're like on the sides of his chest where it kind of reaches in. No, they're, in. they're right here. They're right here on the middle of his chest. I will put up a picture. Um, you guys know how to okay, whatever. But, I mean, still, I mean, put it, like, this near your waist or on your sides or something. It's yeah. way easier than chicken winging in it off your chest. I mean, like, Argh. Well, chicken wing would be like this, like, where you're grabbing your arms. Look at where the, look where the fucking it's handle is. It's in the middle is. of his fucking chest. No, it is pointed upwards oh, towards his shoulder. Chicken wing. Yeah, fair enough, I can see. <laughs> Already fighting, babbling a bit. Um, yeah, so. Those are some sweet socks he's got. God damn it, Pelican. The game. And I'm trying to be funny. <laughs> Sonner Definitive Edition. Oh. <laughs> Dishonor Definitive Edition. Uh, very This chick, and for some reason, she would just randomly change into a yes. British accent, and it was really oh, fucking weird and annoying. Oh, who was that? Yeah, oh, you're back. Like, hey, it's Emily. Like hey, the there, Emily. Or something. Oh, your hand it was fucking weird, weird, though. My fingers look so much better. Are there any will? My daughter yeah. looks so much cuter. I guess. I'll cover my eyes. I don't know. Do you have time? Way to spoil the story for me, Dan. That's not a spoiler. <laughs> well, kind of. Uh, shh. Skip this part. Uh, I'm sorry. We have played this other. beginning about three different right. times. I know, and I always feel really bad, even though she's just a bunch of pixels. <laughs> Damn, don't get emotionally attached. Oh, Everybody oh. dies. <laughs> Lord Protector. Hey, look, Stop it's moving, fucking Stuff Campbell. Love and Campbell. You, Corvo, and welcome Campbell's back. painting, and I'm gonna go right, steal a fucking you. pot. <laughs> I like how there's a painting in a game that's all been painted. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's kind of cool. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment. I'll probably I'll see you. A <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. What are you doing? I need the bottle to draw the eye away from Campbell. I shall see you at once. It's like the not creeper mustache. It's because he's old. <laughs> <laughs> They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. There. So you can tell he's lying because he's twitching his thumb through his fingers. He's putting it through his fingers. Very well. I like how it's just the same animation over and over again for his fingers. Mother, Corvo is. I like how he's a vampire. Leave us be. As you wish, Your Majesty. He does kind of like vampire. He just looks like a cunt, doesn't he? No, he looks like a vampire. Two days early. Of surprises. It's a very flat usual. chest and abs. Like they don't You're have vampires. any vampires. They don't have any motion to them at all. Some vampires are like nice looking. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. me. What news have you brought? You should leave them. Here's yeah, your shit. Oh, okay, there's no whale on that ship. There was a whale on that last time. Last time, how many times have you played this? this? Probably before. like six times. <laughs> this news is very bad. We're at the breaking oh. point. Cowards. 
They're going to blockade us. Literally. Is she supposed to be like what the queen? Mm -hmm. This looks uh, actually a lot okay, better than it did. Uh, yes, and don't worry. The 360 darling. version. Mother is fine. Yeah. Yeah. Like Wait, how much? Where are the guards? Like a lot better. Who sent the water me? actually looks Mother, like look. more what like water. What? Emily, um, come here. Oh god, there's a guy right there. Girl. Emily, get behind me. Do you want to do star fighting ghosts? Look out! Another one. I guess. No, there are ghosts, obviously. <laughs> Definitely ghosts. Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here, ah, no ghost more. powers activate. Money. Ghost oh, fighting. They shouldn't have built their city on Indian burial oh, grounds. Oh, See, that's what happens. You go show up and kill your mom. Like completely killing the whole mood of what this part's supposed to be. It's supposed to be. Oh, but it's Come the beginning of the game, and you have no attachment to any of the characters because you barely knew them at all. Her. She follows you around the rest of the story. Well, yeah. I don't know what to do. That makes the attachment, you... not the beginning. Cool. It's like, oh, dead. Now I'm going to jail. What the fuck? What a soul. Look at what he's done. Hmm. Yes, he's killed the Empress. We're playing the blame game, guys. I, I told you I liked your you mustache. Young lady Emily, traitor. Her How own dare bodyguard. You. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away and no one will ever know the truth. So what are we doing? Uh, waiting for this cutscene because Falcon's sleeping already. God, how does he not take a nap before him? <laughs> like, that is one of our. Th we had so okay, much. Okay, no, time. I can't. I can't tell who that is in the back. Is oh, it's that guy. Is that guy? Yeah. They both are like following the same so. They look so similar. Kai, like, we're gonna cut your brains out. Oh, you ready? The right time. Let's God, confess. They are so creepy. They're supposed to be. Goodbye. Uh, yeah, anyway. Yeah, well, Lawrence here. Sonic. He was, uh, doing some other shit. I beat this game, uh, once. Only once? Oh, well, it's You're shitty. pretty proud of my record. This meal comes this. from a friend. This is probably my favorite game. Um, uh, ever? Probably. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, that's my message. Uh, it's from Anonymous. Who we are is irrelevant right now. Just know that we have faith in you. Here is the key to your cell. Once you're out, no, head you, for the... Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you you can pause it and read it. You don't have to do that. Pause it and read it if you really care. Uh, we have both. Are you sure? So yeah. Fucking goddamn it. <laughs> eh, I'm gonna go stealthy bits. The one who killed the Empress, abducted her daughter, Emily. You just wait. So it's in for a case. second, then I'll right. kill him, and then I'll kill him. For the high and yeah, I tried to, uh, first play through this game, I tried to get those, like, super hard achievements, and, uh, it didn't work out too well. Oh, the Because, uh, because it was my first try. And it's, so I gave up on the game a lot. Oh, really? And then, uh, came back to it, and I decided to beat it. Unless accompanied yeah, by an officer of the law. Yeah, I Escort the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's oh, notice. Shit. Oh, good shit. You already fucked up. Did you sneeze? Spit. You sneezed in half. God. It's not enough disease running around. The guards gotta sneeze on the fucking floor. 
He can see me, I'm sure. There's a fucking guy nope. standing up on this thing. Nope. How does he not see me? There's no lights on you. You're fucking the fucking thing. Stupid goddamn numbers somehow. Turn your fucking oh, back down. Really dirty ass. Dude, look at this fucking burned to shit. Alright, I hear footsteps. Alright, bye. I'm back now. So I got keys and shit, and like, I'm gonna have to fucking steal a key, and then still choke him out because hit your face on the wall. Getting this bomb. Uh, that was also in the note from the beginning. Um, sneaky game, sneaky game. Do we have the sneaky game? So, that was the stuff. Ackworth, you lazy slug. Did you control the yard? Meh. Stuff. Oh shit. Oh shit. I know how to fucking do this shit. Okay! That was a little worse than I've never done a high chaos thing. So, I think that might be this one. I'm on a hard mode, so. Execution is no one else heard that, I guess. Yeah, but everything has to be set Okay. Um, I guess I can go back this way. I really want to. Everyone did. I really like it. Fucking longer do I have to. Fuck. Yeah. Turn your fucking head, bitch. <laughs> you're not normally like this. Why are you like this? Because you're hard. <sighs> I was playing on very hard last time. We still did that. Steal his shit. I can't take his shit. Why can't I take his shit? Fuck. But yeah, this is the deluxe edition, so there's uh, the Brigmore Witches and Knife of Dunwall DLCs, as well as uh, the Trials and uh, Void Workers Arsenal. Blue face. Oh yeah, Blood Warning. Um, Did you know that rats can um, uh, can um, uh, get through any hole that's the size of a pencil? I feel like that's wrong. Well, they can get through, they can get into a house if there's a hole the size of a pencil. Because they can stick their nose in it and then they chew it open until they can fit through it. Okay, I was like, they can't fit through a pencil hole though because their skull is a bit 
Okay, there's a rats eating these people. Oh, Only. Why don't they just close the doors? Because they're fighting off the rats. I don't know why they don't, though. He's already dead, though. And they're eating him. And now the guy's just like, okay, my day's good. Oh, he tried to pull out his sword, but he doesn't have one for some reason. Because they wanted him to die. Yeah. I think that was more of like the Should I? There's a body. Eat the body. Oh god, they're still attacking me. You poop. Gross. Oh, you had to get through here anyway. Okay. Uh. Oh, Corpses. They died loving each other, though, I guess. And there's the journal that goes with that, and it's kind of all Romeo and Juliet like. So, read that if you like. It's kind of cool. Don't read kids. Readings for chumps. And uh, people who like to be cool. Um, like chumps. Yeah. Noam Chomsky. <laughs> that was a person. I think. Did they ever find out why the rats are so ravenous? Uh, other than it's like just that type of plague, I guess. He exploded. That's because I don't think you're supposed to explode. I don't think you are, but like, that's your dicks. I don't know why, like, uh, the developers put this here so the rats couldn't follow you, but the, it's just fucking that. Like, the rats could obviously follow me. And then there's a bunch of bodies over here. It wasn't like anything much, but. Oh. This is the weirdest fucking place for graffiti. Yeah. So. You have worse endings for it. So? Well, I'm just saying, that's... Yeah, be the bad guy for once. I'm never the bad guy in this. That's one of the few yeah, so types of how do you have a worse ending? There, there's multiple endings you can get in this, and by being the bad guy you get uh, more weepers and stuff because of the more dead bodies. Also, you get, like... I guess worse karma. Woo, karma. But it's it, not like they... it does actually pan out in the end where it fucks you up a little bit. Hello, like, now cut back in. Boosh. Whoa. No, that's not a spoiler. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, that didn't work at all. I didn't think I'd get on this ledge. Oh shit. Um. Oh. Whoa. Oh, Come back in right there. God. <laughs> oh. Oh, now I remember how this game goes. He has a bolt in his knee. Let's see too. Oh, oh fuck. To the knee. Did you just shoot him in the nuts? I don't know where I shot, shot him. him in the dick. I don't know where I shot him. Let's see where I shot cool. him. It's not cool to shoot people. Where's this guy's head? <laughs> Dude, it's yours though. Those really big ears. I'm like a monkey. Boop! <laughs> surprise! Head. What the fuck? You got a surprise, bro. Where's the head? Give me the head. Ow! Nope! Okay, dead already. Um, yeah. I was trying to pick up the head and throw it back at him. Um, this one time I was Pelican and I went, um, I and woke up and, uh, didn't work out, um, went to the kitchen and, uh, my mom was making pie won't get past and, uh, I, you know who we're I took it out of the oven and I was like, what can I make pie? Wow, way to be a dick and take credit for your mom's work, you piece of shit. Asshole Pelican. Yeah, Pelican, God. So, uh. Have you guys ever fallen asleep while listening to music? <laughs> Dude, yes, I have. I actually so I did that last night. For a few yeah. months I did that like, but that like my thing. 
Do you ever like get that sense where like you kind of like wake up and you're still like listening to music and you're just like, oh my god, this sounds amazing. No. And then, I do that all the time. Like that's terrible. I listen to music and then when I fall asleep, I'm still listening to it. So I'll like kind of be half awake and like this part will play and I'll just be like, this sounds fucking amazing. And then I'll listen to it the next day and I'm like, I can't. I can't find it. I can't find the part Dude, that sounded amazing. Never. But I don't know what it was, but it always sounds like crazy amazing when I'm asleep if listening to music. If I wake up and there's music playing, I go into instant freak out mode. Really? I'm like, that is some scary shit. Why is there music playing right now? Because one time when I lived by myself think, yeah. out in the trailer, um, I was listening to music on my computer before I went to bed, and then. I was going to go to bed, so I promptly turned off my computer, off with the sound, all of that stuff, went to bed, got woke up in the middle of the night, oh, because my trailer night. door was open. Wait a minute. The door was <laughs> wide open, and my computer was playing System of a Down all the way up. That is that is a little sketchy. That is a little sketchy. And I woke up like half distraught, just like what's going on? And uh, I like threw the blankets off, stumbled my way to the freaking computer, and I turned it off because I was like legitimately scared. And uh, I just kind of sat there at my computer for a while, pondering what could have happened. I never really found out. I have a small uh, story along those lines with uh, waking up to music. Um, like five or six years ago, I went on a trip with my dad and his at the time girlfriend uh, to Florida. And I remember waking up one of the days and like, uh, in my dream there was this Did like- freeze? Huh? Did it freeze? No, oh, okay. Was, oh. Sorry, I, I wasn't paying attention. Um, he was giving me the option to talk. Uh, and ended up uh, waking up really weirdly where um, for like the last part of my dream that I remembered uh, had faded in because they were watching like the morning show and there was music on it and like the music became like a music video in my dream have you guys ever had that happen like the outside no. sounds like as you're fading into reality no no okay nah. me neither <laughs> <laughs> Even though you just told us the story, <laughs> you didn't want to go with <laughs> I um, actually one time I fell asleep um, on my phone. Like I was, I was, text, I was sitting on my, I was, I was laying on my stomach with my phone at my face, and I just fell asleep like that. And I, like the phone was pressed against my eyeball, and in the dream. There was like this screen of text that was kind of blurred over everything that was happening. And now that you and I couldn't quite read the text, but I was like, what the fuck? Why am I seeing like two things at once? There's like a screen in front of me. And then there's also the dream that's happening behind it. And then I woke up to a big bright white screen in my face. And I was like, oh, <laughs> and that's probably it, huh? You know, like, <laughs> out of all the people that I've had to, like, do things to when they're asleep, that sounds terrible. <laughs> um, like, turn off their, uh, things or, like, pull books out of their hands or something if they've fallen asleep like that. I think I've turned your phone off the most out of anybody else. Mine? Yeah. Oh, you fall asleep it. with, like, your phone an inch from your fucking face. That's how I text. Yeah, I know. And Maybe. then you just fall asleep and it's just, like, a picture of boobs or something. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's a good way to fall asleep, but still. Cut that bit. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's, it's never a picture of boobs. But it's, like, just a Not white yet. screen of some sort. <laughs> I don't make it a point to uh, read your shit, though, so... I'm I guess it could have been. A true servant of the Empire. <laughs> he's like looking at me like really weird. He's like, continue with the Lord boob Lord story. <laughs> he's intrigued. Hmm. He's enthralled, actually. Boobies, you say? <laughs> I would <laughs> definitely <laughs> take some of those boobies. See? What is the answer for boobies? <laughs> Show them. I like them big. I'm going to come out. We've been Here's some beer for your boobies. He's like, yeah. Ending boobs. <laughs> Drink a beer. Boobs. We're completely not even doing the like, severity of the situation. We've got big plans. Mm. 
joining the can't uh, do any large of nipple society. We need your skill. Your we need bigger breasts. And in helping us, we're going to You're help the man to get them. Get them. Who murdered you. Fetch. <laughs> Grab them. We can discuss beer. this further after you grab beer. the beer. But before you retire, <laughs> those titties you should beer. introduce yourself to Piero. This challenge. Fun fact: Piero is kind of taken from Leonardo da Vinci's full name, Leonardo da Piero da Vinci. Piero is much an artist. He's Sir Piero. Sir Piero. I'm you fucking butchering the pronunciation of that shit. Piero. Piero. Talk to him. Piero. Piero. It sounds like a magician. We can talk it's more when you get. D I S E R Piero. Piero. Where'd he go? Nobody knows. He's right there. He's really bad at disappearing. <laughs> Leonardo the bright orange blazer. <laughs> we see you behind that curtain, Disappearo. At least fucking Corvo's like costume, how it's black and uh, it's mostly black, makes sense to do with like hiding and shit. And like, I guess I'm a big fan of uh, Assassin's Creed and stuff, as you guys know. Uh, viewers might not. Of course um, we know. God, we I fucking have a coat and stuff. But like, uh, those things are not good for hiding. Like, the coats and shit, they're all white and fucking flowy in their robes and stuff. Like, for an assassin, you'd want to be like blending in and shit. It might, they're just like in hopes that it'll snow one day. Like, we told you. Ready. It'll snow and it'll rain blood, so it's like the yeah. rain and white. Magic. Yeah. In hopes that a group of uh, priests in white robes walk by. Yeah, I know. Like it makes sense to do with like the Middle Ages one, but. There's actually reflection on glasses. Better now. Great. I could create more. I still have it. Oh my god, I still Upgrades have it. I have a no fucking stalker. Room, it's 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 stupid. Our situation um, is desperate. I technically have two rooms, but you know. I will resell them on the black market. Huh. That should give us the money to crash. I should get a tobacco pipe. <laughs> Not for actually using, just <laughs> carrying around. Just, just to carry it around and get yeah. out. That's what it's for, I think. Let's have a look at your web. Well, I'll probably cut this part out because it's more mistakes. Let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. Let's sleep guards. Let's sleep guards. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should well, rest. I don't know if I have any more stories. <laughs> Dude, if I wore, like, if I don't, I don't well. necessarily need glasses, but if I did wear glasses, I'm pretty sure they'd be circle frame. And I don't know why. Well, uh, I think it looks cool. you'll probably join us next episode for somewhere else. We probably... Oh, this is it? This is the end? Well, no, it's the end of no, this part. It's over? It's the end no. of this part. And oh. then we're going to...